Sir, without certification, we have no actual proof that you are disabled. No proof? All right, I'll look. I'll give you some damn proof. Does you want some proof? You want some proof? You want some proof? Here's the damn proof. I got the proof. Here's the proof right here. Welcome to Monument Heights Veterans Hospital. My name is Dr. Peter Morgan. It's my first day here. Oh! The government's come up with a whole new disease called the creeping cutback. Whatever you need, you ain't gonna get. And whatever you get, ain't worth jack. We're not responsible for every lunatic out there just because he wants more our uniform. Hey, baby, what's happening? Now, Rudy, let's go! Okay, next batter. Would you use as an anesthetic the electric chair? When you're in the war... Treatment they authorize he doesn't need. They won't authorize the treatment that he does. So the idea is to keep him here until they finally do. Let's go. It's like a war going on in there. Tell me about it, kid. I operate this hospital in the best interest of our patients. This hospital operates with only one interest, your own. When you're under the knife. This patient needs open heart surgery. I thought heart surgery was no longer authorized. Look, we're here. He's here. Why don't we make the most of this? I need to get rid of certain dysfunctioning elements you think the priorities are, are cutting the budget instead of easing the suffering and the anxiety of the people that this place was built for when the heroes are forgotten they yeah, take this i got nobody else to give it to look everything's gonna be all right when the bottom line is life or death you better treat him as well as you treat your father so help me god i'll break your neck there's one rule you've got to break article 99 Article 99. Article 99. <laughs> One choice you've got to make. That's far enough. Disarm that man. Before 25 an hour. Pull. Nine.